block unwanted Facebook friends and their posts from your fan page. Welcome back to the ClickCom.com video series on how to use Facebook for business. This video will demonstrate on how to block unwanted posts and friends that are not treating the network appropriately. Unfortunately, people can set pretty nasty stuff on Facebook, but Facebook allows us to control the content on our business page as well as our personal site. Okay, well, let's get started. Okay, here we are at our homepage, and what we're going to do is go over to the Help Center. Go to Friends, Blocking People. Then there's a whole section on blocking people, how, why, how to unblock. We're just going to cover blocking and the first two bullet points today. First, let's just read about what is blocking. I'm going to go ahead and stop the frame here so we can kind of get an overview. A block prevents specific people from viewing your profile. Any ties you currently have with the people you block will be broken. Friendships, uh, connections, friend details, etc. Your profile will not be visible to them and you will not appear in their search results or friend list. Blocking is mutual, so they will also become invisible to you. Keep in mind that blocking someone may not prevent all communications and interactions in third-party applications. That you don't have to really worry about and does not extend to elsewhere on the internet. Please note that removing a block will not restore connection. So you can restore a connection, but you have to go and do a friend request again. Sorry about reading to you guys, but I wanted to make sure we understood what blocking was. So here we go. We'll resume the video. Now we'll go ahead and block someone. There's three main ways to block someone. The first one is under privacy settings. And we'll do a tutorial on all the privacy settings later on, but here's one for just blocking. It's the last one on the list. And there's an actual little box that you can look for someone to block. This is probably the most direct way to do it. I'm going to block my brother. It's my baby brother, works with me. He won't get too mad. We can make him friends again later. So then after you find Nick, you come down to the left side of the page and report or block Nick. We're going to also cover a little bit of reporting on this tutorial as well. So we're going to go ahead and we would have clicked on that, but since we really don't want to block him, we go back to the help screens, go to blocking people, and we're going to go to the second way on how to block someone. If you can't find them in that little box that we looked at on step number one, then we can go ahead and search their profile. Just go up to the top, the Facebook search bar. Now here is my SEO manager and Jim's smiling face and we'll block him. He shouldn't get too mad at me while I'm blocking him later. Actually, I'm not going to block anybody today. Just go through this step one step to, until we're almost out of block and then I'll cancel out. And then we go to the bottom left again and remove from friends. You notice that if we did it this way, you have two options, block or remove. Remove is the easiest, simplest way. We're going to stop right here. If we do a block or report, you can see that we start having different opportunities to pick why. You can see nudity or pornography. I actually had pornography the other day come up to one of my friend, friend pages. So I had to block that person and now she'll never be able to post anything to my page again. So you do have to be careful and you have to keep an eye out, especially if you're running a large net network like us. We have over 1,500 friends now. You have to make sure people aren't posting stuff you don't want. Fake profile, cyberbullying, you know, Facebook is always adding and deleting to this drop down. So they want to make sure that the network stays safe for businesses and all people. So here we go. Gives you different opportunities. 
and depending on the opportunity to block or why to block it'll give you a statement on okay click here to finish the block now I'm going to cancel Jim because we don't want to have Facebook think that he's putting in a fake profile so we'll go ahead and cancel it out if I would have clicked that button he would have been reported I'm sure Jim appreciates that so now we'll go back to help center friends blocking people how do I block someone and the last way is you can actually report someone that has either a post a negative post or a negative message or spamming you so we'll go find somebody that has sent us a message um, we get a lot of messages I don't consider it any any spam at this point because we are contacting a lot of people to grow our network but if I would think that Marco was spamming me I would just click on that link right there now I did click it so I'm gonna undo it so Facebook doesn't think that he's spamming so you can undo a blocked friend or a spam or report a message or a post unlike blocking a friend you have to re you have to request a friend to join again here we go we can find Marco try to block him if we want so now back to block people and just to recap we can go to number one which is straight the block search bar as you remember number two search a fan page or a friend page or number three we can go ahead and next to any post we can remove or report someone for sending bad messages spammy messages posting bad things just about anything that is posted to a profile or your wall you can go ahead and report or block so hopefully that will help you out and check back next time